This is an interactive story. Your choice is from one of many perspectives. No single path holds all the answers. Okay. Okay, I guess we're just jumping right into the story. <laughs> anyway, hello everyone. Welcome to my Let's Play of Erica. It's an FMV game. So, um, I figured there would be some type of, like, um, menu or something, but I guess not. I'm going to be completely quiet for the, the whole thing. But I am going to be putting on... Face time. I don't have a camera for the P uh, PlayStation, uh, Tyree. Um, I uploaded a video on YouTube um, that I made with my camera and long story short I made it so that only people 18 and plus can watch the video and the reason why I did that is because of the whole YouTube um, algorithm thing there with COPPA and all that I mean there was no swearing or anything dirty about the game, but I just can't trust YouTube. They threw their users under the bus by not even obeying with the law, and now we're paying for it, so I'm protecting my ass. <laughs> uh, yeah. If you have an account on there, you need it. Your account needs to be, like, you know, d to know that you're 18 plus. Um, my account is a New Jersey fan. Capital N. N-E-W-J-E-R-S-E-Y. Yeah, it's, it's not the same, Tyree. Tyree, you're younger than that. That's what, that's what Tomo tells me. <laughs> Tomo told me you were 13. Yeah. Sorry about that. If it wasn't for that, I would definitely have it fine. I would just be like, yeah, anybody could see it. Moral of the story, don't trust YouTube. They throw their users under the bus. Because they can't themselves comply with the law. So, people can't make whatever they want for content. If it's, if it's not kid-friendly, and they have kid-related stuff in their channels then people can get sued $42,000 and also be banned on YouTube and maybe even end up in jail. But, again, you know. I might, 13, or I might sound 13 on the mic. No, don't listen to Tomo, she's crazy. Okay. <laughs> Uh, I would love to hear what Tomo would say if she was here right now. Part of me says you're lucky. She'd be like, wow, Tigery. <laughs> I don't know. Who knows, she might agree with you. I don't know how she how she thinks. But anyway. Alright, so this game is going up on PlayStation Plus um, July offerings this upcoming Tuesday. I figured I'd beat everybody to the punch and play this game now. I was going to play it at a later date, but I thought, you know what, why do it at a later date when I can do it now, beat everybody to the punch, and maybe try to get as many views as I can. Who knows? I don't know. Whatever. Anyway, so I am going to be gone quiet for this, and it's an interactive game. So um, I'm going to treat this as a movie, and I'm going to keep quiet, and I hope um, everyone enjoys what they watch of Erica. Um, what is it about? I... not 100% sure. <laughs> hey, Danny Blizzard! 
I welcome. Are you at work? You at work right now? I never even asked you last night if you work from home. Because she's so crazy that a sane person can't even think how she thinks. Okay. <laughs> if you say so, Tyree. But yeah, Danny, that for the forest last night was um, awesome. That was fun. <laughs> I want to go back and watch that stream, though. That was pretty funny. Anyway. So yeah, I'm going quiet. It's going to be movie mode. Um, Alright, so uh, yeah. Um, I wanted to... Uh, um, I'm not really sure. Oh, here we go. No. Uh, I gotta do everything with touchpad? Oh my lord. Because I need to use an app. sure why Wi-Fi hotspot. I don't know. I'm not, I don't know what that is. I think that's what the uh, thing there. I don't have a tablet or a cell phone, so that's off the road. Uh, off the road. I don't know what that means. Uh, that's off the uh, off the ticket, basically. But yeah. Well, if you got some time to kill Danny, maybe you can um, listen to the story of what happens in this game. I'm just starting. Like literally, just starting. Alright, um, so I'm going mute. Like I said, I'm treating this as a movie. I hope you all enjoy. called Delphi House. 
She was a nurse. I was a doctor. At night, we tell each other stories. She tell me about the future. Wonderful things. Things only she could see. I tell her about the past. That great priestess, marked with a butterfly, who could stare into the fire and see the future. I used to tell her she was magic, just like the priestess. I think you're magic too. But you're gonna have to prove it. Pick your photograph. Pick your favor. Now, close your eyes. Focus your mind and conjure the power of the ancient priestess. Now find your mom again. See if you can guess where your favorite is. Disaster. Don't worry. I still think you're magic. She'll always be with you. Remember that. Even though she isn't here, she's still a part of you. If you could stare into the fire and see the future, what do you think you'd see?
you need any help? Miss Mason, I'm Sergeant Blake, the lead investigator on this case. Can I see that? I promise I'll give it back. You draw this a lot. It's Greek, isn't it? The Delphic Epsilon. How do you know that? I read your father's file. I had to. The hand belonged to a Kal Jahar. He worked at Delphi House. I believe he visited there with your father. What does this have to do with me? Your father's case was never solved. We think there might be a connection. Did you know he co-founded Delphi House with this man, Lucian Flowers? We think Mr. Flowers might be a target too. We're keeping watch over at Delphi House. Protection detail. I'll be leading the investigation from there. Right now, it's the safest place for you too.
They're probably out for a smoke. Wait here, I'll go check. says this is a bad time for you to come and see her. We're in a important stage of her treatment. It's just not coming. I don't care what he says. I want to see her. Give me his work. You need to calm down. You're tired. Emotional. Oh, Jesus Christ, Rosa. People are dying. They took his hand. We have nothing. No prints. No witnesses. We don't even know if he got him. What are you doing? See you found someone. I guess I should have just stayed put. I saw some girls. They were wearing masks. They, they... Yeah, I'll check it out. I think it's some kind of therapy. Who are you? I'm Sergeant Blake. I'm leading the investigation. I'm supposed to meet a Dr. Ballard. I can only apologize. We're all a bit nervous here. Sergeant Blake, I'm Rosa Ballard. I suppose you already know. Chief Inspector? Sir, this is Erica Mason. I'm sorry we're meeting in such difficult circumstances. Is there anything we can do to make you feel at home? It's okay. I uh, appreciate what everyone's doing. Come on. I'll show you the way. I suppose you don't remember me. I worked with your father. I used to look after you when you were little. I'm sorry, it was, it was a long time ago. Oh, it's okay. I was much prettier back then. Anyway, this is you. You might recognize it. Mr. Steinbeck, the night manager, will be downstairs if you need anything.
got you. It should keep you out of trouble. Just like you. I said you could help, but if you're going to be cleaning, I need to be here with you. No cleaning without supervision. She's got emotional problems. Hurry up and die, Hannah. I'm doing my best. What are you playing? This. Aria Fidelphi by, um... Some guy. I don't know. I've never heard of him. Here. Take a seat. Let me show you something. Do you see this bit? It's simple. Four notes. Bam, 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 bam. I'll do the rest.
doing? Here we fucking go. No, 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 no cleaning! No cleaning without supervision! Percy! It's okay, they won't mind. No, 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 no. Don't, no, you don't can't. you dare. It's not loud. Kirsty, no, no, Kirsty, no, no, calm down! No! Calm down! No! Get off! No! Get off! Get off! Get off! Just like your mother. <laughs> Last time we met, you could <laughs> barely see over the desk. I'm Lucien Flowers. I set this place up with your father. I uh, recognize you from your portrait in the hall. Oh dear, it's quite a statement. If it wasn't for your father, I'd have it replaced. Did you sleep okay? I know the old place can take a bit of getting used to. Steinbeck, yes. I believe he was rather rude. I can only apologize. I'll be speaking to him personally. I know it's very difficult for you to be here. And it's not much, but I brought you something. It was your father's. Your mother gave it to him on their wedding day. I just... Sorry about that. I was just getting an update from forensics. Erica, it's extremely likely whoever killed your father killed Mr. Johar. There may be some other victims as well we don't know about. Am I in danger? All we know for sure is that whoever killed Johar has taken an interest in you. Honestly, we don't have much to go on. But Mr. Flowers has a suggestion. It might help you remember the face of your father's killer. I get flashes. Nightmares a, a silhouette woman with a gun, but... It's like therapy. It was developed by your father, and it might be able to help you with your nightmares. It's completely painless. Perfectly safe. Okay. Okay, I'll do, I'll do it. The images you're going to see are designed to relax you and open up your mind. Your father designed regression therapy to help our patients face their trauma. The first one is just a test. When you see it, just say whatever comes into your head. Peace. Okay, great. If you remember anything important, just write it down. I know revisiting trauma can be difficult, but you're perfectly safe. Let's begin.
nature. Faith. Farm. Danger. Mask. Kill. Animals. Why did you draw her, Erica? Why did you draw your mother? Your mother told me this place was her whole life. She worked here, fell in love here, had you here. Later, she died here. Dr. Ballard suggested that I show you this. Putting yourself through that was incredibly brave. It's not surprising that you saw your mother. It's a process, Erica. It takes time. You can't blame yourself. I want to try again. You need to rest. Clear your mind. You can try again another time. Come on. There's something I want to show you. You'll need these.
Your father had the oleander planted in your mother's memory. They were her favorite. They've always brought us luck. Sorry. Sometimes the girls have difficult days. But some of us like to keep it buried deep down inside. Anna, I didn't think you'd be up. This is Erica Mason. She'll be staying with us for a while. Didn't I bleed all over you this morning? I'm taking these to Doc Ballard. We're making perfume. Do you want to come? Uh, Fuck off! What is wrong with you? Oh, you could always go hang out with Toby. Actually, they're about to serve lunch. It's quite a spread. Why don't you go and grab yourself a bite and maybe meet some of the other girls? Sure. Who doesn't love a good old soggy sandwich in the company of strangers? I guess I could go meet some other girls. No, not the cake. They're watching. Have the fruit. They like it when you have the fruit. It's pretty. It's a butterfly. Just like you. Aren't you hungry? You have to eat. If you don't eat, you'll waste away. And we have work to do. You missed a spot. Here. What did you mean at lunch when you said they were watching? Oh, yeah. It's for our own good, but they can't see everywhere. Come, they always do. Who? Who's coming? They're all part of it. If you saw the flowers, you'd know. Kirsty? Kirsty, what are you doing? I have to be good or they'll hurt him. You're not supposed to have the door closed. It's okay. The mop fell, but I fixed it. Erica was helping. Look under the pillow. Show you the animals. Then they give you the pink stuff and you forget. Look under the pillow. You'll see. I like the rabbits best. 
They're my favorite. Hello? Jesus, you scared the crap out of me. It's from Doc Ballard. A little housewarming present. Perfume. No, thank you. Uh, I don't need it. <laughs> You're hauled up in a makeshift bedroom in a mental hospital. Trust me, this will make your life better. Yeah. I, I guess you're right. It's okay, we all have rough days. All done. You just turn the dial and you're good to go. Got the cat dragged in. Where the hell have you been? I've been looking everywhere. You've got mail. Looks expensive. Oh, it's so pretty. Open it. This is hideous. Be careful. Box was mailed yesterday. We're still trying to get a description of the sender. Here, take a look at this. That's Carl Steinbeck's place, the night manager. Got a team there now. 
is missing. Was it his? The skin? No, it's not official. But it's the same tattoo. Is he dead? There's no body. But it doesn't look good. And then there's this. Why send the doll? gift from Lucian. He gave it to me before my father died. Erica used to spend so much time here, there weren't any other children. I always tried to smuggle her some toys or a treat. This is one of many. We're gonna have to go back to your flat. I need you to have a look around. Make sure there's nothing else missing. You can grab some extra clothes, whatever else you need. Looks like he might be here for a while. You okay then? Check if the neighbors saw anything. Stay there. Keep the door shut. Police! Open the door or the door will be forced open. The door is about to be forced open. Get up. 
need to get out of here. Karlsteinek is dead. I like Hannah. She's funny and kind. But she must have been bad because she's sick. I hope she gets better. But you should sign a card just in case. The last one didn't get better. She was Toby's friend. She used to draw a lot, even though she was really strange. They caught her looking for ghosts down in the basement. Guess that's pretty bad. When you're bad, they take you away and show you the animals. Then you forget. My daddy told me about it. But I have been bad. They know I talk to you. They broke the tape. That's how I know. See? seen it they'll take you away and make you forget you can't get inside you haven't got a key Bella took her. Where? What does it matter? She's not coming back. I have strange dreams. I beat Bella's fool of all around me. Toby, you're bleeding. Just going to go over some of the evidence from the flat. Most of what we've got is back in the lab. There's a couple of things we'd like you to look at. There's no need to worry. The chief inspector asked that we do it here. Why aren't we doing it at the police station? You've been through enough, Eric. Uh, we just want you to be as comfortable as possible. Come on then, kettle's on. Chief Inspector. What do you think? Are we close? Is that her?
Okay. What about this? We found it in her apartment. Her name is Mia Green. She was a patient at Delphi House. She was very close to your mother. She was very protective of her. Sometimes aggressively so. What was wrong with her? She was difficult, sometimes violent. Her childhood was extremely unpleasant. Your mother's friendship gave her great comfort. Erica. The night your mother died, Mia Green broke into the dispensary. She took an overdose and died. filed an order with the judge to exhume the body. Until then, we're working with the phone company to try and get a lead on that phone call. You need some help? No, no, I've got it. Blake, would you like it? Corker residence. Yes. This is Sergeant Blake. Right away. I've got to go. There's an intruder at Delphi House. I'm coming with you. Not you. It's not safe. I'm going. No, Erica. He's right. There's nothing you can do. Erica, are you okay? You're bleeding. Go, go. I'll, I'll look after him. Bathroom through there, down the hall. Can't miss it.
want from me? I came for him. For Steinbeck. And for Droha. They were in it together. I'd never hurt you. You're insane. He gave them his daughter. His own flesh and blood. I'm here to protect you. You've ruined my life. Your father made me a monster. He took your mother and locked her away. He sold his soul to the devil and she was the price. There's another world beneath Delthy House. Secret passages and hidden doors to get you there. I gave you the medallion, the key to everything. But you gave it away. But there's another. It's right there in front of you. <gasps> the locks are in the walls. Find one and see for yourself. There's an old farm out in the woods, between here and Delphi House. I'll wait for you there. Come alone. I should have stayed. There was no one here. Just one of the girls trying to break into the pharmacy. Was anyone hurt? Some cuts and bruises. Nothing major. <laughs> some sleep. You'll be safe here, I promise you. I'll be fine. Are you sure she didn't say anything? Anything that could help us find her? if you need anything. It's not for you to know. <laughs> it doesn't seem like anything's for me to know at the moment. You just do your job and concentrate on looking after Erica in a proper fashion. A proper fashion. That's all I'm going to say to you.
doing? You can't be here. It's bad. Are you okay? He's dead. My daddy's dead. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. He's dead. He's dead and I have nowhere else to go. It doesn't matter what I do, they're going to take me and they're going to make me bleed. They're going to make me forget him. I won't let them take you. Whatever's happening here, I'll stop it. What if they catch you? They'll never let you go. I won't let them. I promise.
They seek visions of the future for wealth and power. But they cannot see without a butterfly. That's why they took your mother. That's why they want you. you want or will you join me we can destroy Lucian and set your mother free you can be happy you can be together again You tell me about the future. Wonderful things that only she could see. I'd tell her about the past. About a great priestess. Mark with a butterfly. Why did you bring me here? Because this is where it all began. Your father made it. Breathe it in. And I can make you do anything. I can turn you into a murderer. I can make you cut your own throat. A little housewarming present. Perfume. The rabbit's best. They're my favorite. Strange dreams. It fell 
fooling around. Taking these to Duck Ballard. We're making perfume. <laughs> what do you think he burned in that lamp? Erica? What do you think it did to you? who do. He was one of them. See for yourself. Your father convinced Lucian that by adding science to ritual, they could see into the future and control it. Your mother was the missing piece. You liar. After all I've shown you, after all you've seen, How can you stand there and do nothing? How can you let them get away with it? I don't believe in killing. But they do. And they won't let anyone get in their way. Bleeds before you went to Delphi House. You don't have to trust me, but you know there's something going on here. If I'm wrong, then you can stop me. But if I'm right, only you can put an end to this. away from me. I will never go with you.
Jesus, I've been looking everywhere. What, what happened? Where did you go? You need to go. She's here. It's okay. It's, there's no one here. It's just you and me. it takes. Take this. Promise me. If you need it, use it. I'm not a killer. Promise me. What happened? What's going on? All the lights went off. Do not leave this. Don't go back in there. It's dangerous. I don't want you to get hurt. I don't go. It'll never end. You can't be in here. Toby needs her treatment. What are you doing? They're looking for you. They found a body in the garden. I think you might be unwell. Please, let me help you. Wake her up. That's too dangerous. It's her treatment. You can't just pull her out. It takes time. Wait. Once before the tube's out, she's going to start to fit. But I'll give her some epinephrine. It's in the cabinet. I'll have to put it straight in her heart. Toby! Run, Kirsty! <laughs> Shouldn't be here. I just couldn't leave Toby. We have to wake her up. You have to take the tubes out. <laughs> Do something.
to this. Make it stop. Please. She told me everything. Erica. Lee Green is dead. She died years ago. <laughs> you have to stop this. You have to put the gun down. I think you might be sick. I think you need help. You're not helping them. Making them sick. You're killing them. This is a hospital. We help people. We keep them safe. We make them better. You're dangerous. More dangerous than you know. We all had the same dream. All of us. Let me guess. Pink flowers falling from the sky. It was a gift, Erica. A gift from your father. He designed the treatment. He designed the regression therapy. A pathway to the subconscious paved by a beautiful dream. Your mother's favorite. It was his life's work. And it saved so many people. My God, what have you done? My mother is alive. You have to stop this fantasy. You have to let it go. Hold on to it, you will lose yourself forever. Please.
Erica? Erica, can you hear me? Look, Erica. It's right there. Right there in front of you. See? It's magical. I think you are too. Bronze trophy achieved, farewell. Bronze trophy achieved, service. Bronze trophy achieved, Cali Cal calligraphy. Bronze tro or silver trophy, Christie's BFF. Prisoner, uh, silver trophy achieved. Wow. Um. Um. Wow. That was it. Uh, that was just one of the endings. This game has multiple endings. I don't know how many, but I just know multiple endings. First thing I'll say is this, just me playing this had me going, holy crap, this is awesome, and I love this. And usually these games go on for like... You know, somewhere between an hour and a half to two hours or something like that. And right now, I'm an hour and 53 minutes in, but like 13 minutes of the uh, beginning, I was pretty much basically talking, not really doing much of anything in the game. So with saying that, this was basically an hour and 40 minutes long. I was kind of hoping it would have been longer, but holy crap, the production of this looks like really well and I like how mysterious it is I just I don't know I can't really it's really I really enjoy it um, Sony was behind this game and I would love to see Sony make more games like this because I like these types of games. And just stuff that adds like mystery or, you know, whatever. Not anything like weird and messed up. Like, well, not, I can't say weird and messed up, but, um,. I don't know. Like, this wasn't dark or depressing or anything like that. It was just like... I like the storyline of this. Armageddon and me. Yeah, he's kiss, kiss, bang, bang. Maybe... Maybe baby. Sexy thing. Man for something to happen. Swing time. Big top. Iron bridge waltz. World in, world's in dark. Dark night. Not dead, just different. Acronym. <laughs> My girl. 
HBIV D06 montage. Okay, gold. Feet don't fail me. Last gas station. Nascent? Nascent? Yeah, this is interesting anyway. Sony Interactive Entertainment. President CEO and Sony Interactive Entertainment. Jim Ryan. Sean Layden. But some pictures can't make a good Spider Man movie by themselves. <laughs> well, <sighs> oh, Lordy. <clears throat> well, as for the Spider Man, there's probably some people who do like the Spider Man movies. But honestly, at the end of the day, um, like, the really, like, I don't know, there's quite a few people who probably don't like them, but there's some people who still think they're pretty good, solid movies, but for the people who are, like, knowledgeable about, like, um, somewhat, you know, somewhat to a degree with, uh, Spider-Man and, like, the, uh, Marvel Universe and that, I can understand how, like, a lot of people have some issues with them and stuff like that and whatever. Especially if they're so aware of how Spider-Man should be as a character, Peter Parker. Anyway, but that's not what this is about. But, um, I wish we had more games like this, honestly. I'd rather play this than The, La than the Last of Us 2. <laughs> um, every single time. So this is a game that's going to be free for this month of PS Plus starting Tuesday. I am going to do another playthrough of this. Uh, I'm just trying to think of when. <laughs> kind of want to do another one right away, actually. Um, I almost want to make the same choices, except go maybe a little bit differently um, on aspect of things. Now, I will say this, when I was playing, um, I can't remember what character who said it. Yeah, they canceled that game. I wish they did. <laughs> but anyway, um, as for this game here, they said something about, like, they show you animals, and then they give you pink stuff to help you forget and I'm like okay so I don't know um jeez I, I don't know I'm, my, my brain is still like I wouldn't even say rattled <laughs> it's not even rattled my brain is just still trying to comprehend what I played. But I will say this, when they, they're like, oh, uh, the pink stuff or whatever, this will help you, like, you know, forget things or something like that. That's why I tossed away the, uh, the perfume thing. Because I figured the perfume was bad for me. So that's why I kept going with the way I did. <sighs> Excuse me, I didn't want to kill anybody because... That's the last thing I ever wanted. Um, because I didn't want to be a killer in this game. I wanted to be, you know, more on the peaceful route. But it makes me really want... I want to know what's behind that big door. With the, uh, the symbol. Honestly. And it looks like I'm going to have to do another playthrough, hopefully, to find out. I do really enjoy what I played, though. It is quite engaging. Um, I think we, like I said, I think we, I think Sony needs more games like this, and I understand that costs us. That's probably this probably costs us a lot more than what creating a video game is. Like you know, like you know, your usual animated studio, mocap, and all this stuff, and you know what, whatever. 
Um, I think if they go and get like people to in these terms, cause I will say this: out of all the actors and actresses here, I only knew one person, and it was uh, Mr. Flowers. I think his name is Lucian. Lucian Flowers. Anyway, the black guy. I know him. I've seen him in um, a British show or two. Um, or something like that. I can't remember where I seen him from. But I know... When I seen him, I was like, Oh, this guy's in it. Okay. I can't remember what the show was. But this guy is really good. I like him. He's, he's a pretty good actor from what I've seen. And I haven't seen him in much of anything. But I like him. He's one of those people that have, like, this look about him that's like, yeah, this guy's pretty cool. You know? But, um... Yeah, so this has been Erica. Uh, didn't get quite get the ending I wanted, I guess. Because, like, I know people are gonna be like, well, how do you know what ending you want? Because there's many different endings. Or, there's different endings. Yeah, I understand, but I want to know what's behind that door, and I didn't want to kill. Because I figured that if I killed, then, you know, I'm going to be, like, basically labeled a murderer or whatever. But if I gave in to him, I would be stuck there forever. But they are doing stuff with the girls, I know that. And they said I can see the future, but if these are ghosts that are telling me, hey, people are doing stuff and whatever, blah, 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 then, yeah, I don't know. But that girl that was go also going in the front door of her place at the very, very beginning of the game when I asked her if she was okay, if she needed any help, she did look vaguely familiar. She, I was like, isn't that the girl there that I'm seeing here? Because why would it show her if, there, if she has no importance? Or has nothing to do with the story later on? But what I should have done was go into the room with him. But I was like, nah, I'm going to stay back. And I'm glad I did because the fox. I see the fox. Anyway. Well, uh, like I said, this has been Erica. The game's going to be out for free on PS Plus um, starting this upcoming Tuesday. Um, I am going to be doing a second playthrough of this. I hope everyone's enjoyed uh, me playing through this. Uh, it's really unique and um, it's a lot of fun. Um, I will say this. Tyree. I am going to recommend this to Orejo fully. I'm going to tell him to make sure not to watch any of it if anybody's streaming it. And the reason why is because I don't want him to see any of the outplay or the outcomes or anything like that. It's one of those, uh, like, for me, it's like one of those things where it's like, if you sit and you watch some of the game, then you kind of know if you pick certain out, like, certain things there, how, like, the story's going to play out. So I kind of want him to go into the game not really seeing, or not, not knowing what's going to happen, basically. So, maybe he was here, maybe he's lurking, I don't know. I actually kind of hope not. <sighs> Excuse me. And I think this may be one of those games that Tomo might like as well. I don't know. I'd like to think she would like it. I don't know. It's hard to say with Tomo because I don't really know her that well. But I mean, free is free. <laughs> so. Anyway. Again, thank you all for watching. And I will be doing a part two of this game. Um, with me selecting different out, you know, selecting different things to see how much of a change there is so people can see what a, you know, how much of a mix up there is if I go and choose different things. Like at the beginning of the game, when I seen the three girls going by with the masks, I was like, I want to check that out. But see if, 
if this was actually a, a full-fledged movie that you'd be watching in theaters, there's always something happening that it's like, hey, look at this weird, wacky thing that's going on over there. And it's like, oh my god, I'm so mesmerized by it. And then all of a sudden, uh, like in this case, in the game, I'm going to use this as a perfect example. Um, all of a sudden, a phone will ring off to the far side of the room. And it's like, do I go answer the phone? Or do I go and follow the f females with the masks? It's like, yeah, the phone is quite, you know interesting you know because like it rains right at that moment but I want to go investigate the creepy looking girls that would just walk by with the masks that interests me more <laughs> I want to go check this <laughs> you know so yeah yeah Celeste um, I want to see Celeste play this as well if there's one thing I will say if you don't have a tablet well, I don't, th I don't know if it works with tablets or not. It just said, like, phone or whatever, Android and whatever else. But maybe it would work with tablet. I don't know. But um, with the controller, even with the touchpad, I find it a bit tricky uh, to play with. But um, but eventually it does... It Like, I had to get used to how uh, it worked. But it's not too bad, it's just kind of a little bit of annoying to like use your thumb or your index finger just to point to the part there that you want to click on and then as soon as you put it over there you have to like let off from it, like going here. So you have to like basically hover, you know, over it and then when it's highlighted you basically let off. But for me, I was just like, I also tapped the, uh, the touch, touchpad to click into things, but you don't actually need to. So anyway. Alright, thank you all for watching. I want to thank Tyree, uh, for popping in. I want to also thank, uh, Danny Blizzard for, uh, popping in as well before she went off to work. Um... And everyone else that has came in and lurked, I thank you for joining. And um, I'll see you for my next stream, maybe? I guess? Which will be more of this game? <laughs> Obviously. <laughs> so, I might play it tonight. If I have nothing to do tonight, I'm going to sit there and I'm going to play it. Um... But I think what I'm going to do for the second time around, maybe, is provide a little bit of commentary. But for the most part, I think I'm going to be mostly quiet, but I may pop in, like, in and out of voice-wise to, like, give, like, opinions or whatever. Oh, and one last thing. That part there where they were like, oh, sign the card, and I'm here, like, scribbling, and I'm like, that's my name. Scribble, scribble, scribble. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I was, just, I was just like, I'm just scribbling on the page there, and I'm like, do, do, do. I'm supposed to write Erica, but I'm here just scribbling. I'm like, do, 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 This is my name. Do, 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 do. If you don't believe me, check my birth certificate. It's just scribble. <laughs> yeah, all right, that's enough. All right. See you, everyone. Thanks for watching. Uh, I'll see you all, um, hopefully for part two. Hope you all, uh, watch the part two of it, uh, see what else of a difference there is in my choices, like how differently the game plays out second time around. Um, I imagine there's going to be different things here and there, so I'm probably most likely just to, um, only do two playthroughs and, and, and upload those on, um, YouTube, because I don't want to do too much, just in case people want to play it. But if people want to see me do more than two playthroughs on YouTube, let me know in the comments below. Alright. See you, everybody.